Governor Scott Walker signed Senate Bill 44 on Monday at Badger Meter and Brown Deer. His signature makes Wisconsin the 25th right-to-work state in the country. Walker said during his remarks the law would be another reform that helps grow Wisconsin's economy. As we add tool after tool after tool for our job creators, this is one more big tool to help places like Badger Meter make the case where they can put jobs anywhere around the world that Wisconsin is the right place because Wisconsin, yet again, is showing we are open for business means more than just a slogan. It means the way of operating and doing business here in the great state. Right to work is already leading to job growth at Badger Meter. CEO Rich Musen plans to open a new production line at their Milwaukee plant in the coming months because of the law. In this particular case, with this new production line, we were debating between Nogales, Mexico, or, or in Milwaukee, which, which plant we would put it in. In fact, we cleared spaces in both plants, and we weren't sure where we were going to where we were going to put it. All of these things that have been happening have made us say, you know what, Milwaukee is a good place to go. Musen also said right to work would allow his business to better compete with non-union shops because workers will not be forced to pay dues. This is one more indicator of the future competitiveness of Wisconsin. It's a, it, it, it's a great factor. The other thing is people forget that 88% of the workers in Wisconsin are not in unions. And when we try to attract some of the workers to come to our plant and we tell them, oh, by the way, you're going to have to pay $800 a year in union dues whether you want to or not. Very often that can cause them to say, you know what, I'll go somewhere else. So I think this can make us more competitive. If those workers want to pay the $800 and join the union, God bless them, that's fine. If they don't want to pay it, they have that choice now. And I think that's wonderful. Wisconsin joins neighbors Indiana, Iowa, and Michigan as the fourth Midwest state to adopt a right-to-work law. For the McIver Institute, I'm Nick Novak.